Welcome to Sandwiches of History. Today is International Sandwich Sunday, and we are headed to the Netherlands for the... Yes, I was not about to try and butcher that. So I found this recipe on a website from Rio Mare, which seems to be a seafood brand, and I am reasonably sure that it is wrong. Uh, the problem is, there seems to be a billion different variants on this sandwich. So let's make it. Uh, see how it goes, and if I'm wrong, I'm sure I'll hear about it in the comments, which is good. Need to learn. First thing we do is add mayonnaise to the bottom half of a baguette, and lettuce, tomato, salt, pepper, and tuna that was packed in oil, drained, and flaked. Okay, let's give this a go. Hard to go wrong with good tuna, good bread, lettuce, tomato, mayonnaise. I do want to plus it up though. I'm going to add some of this with the harissa. It's got garlic, uh, sun-dried chilies, extra virgin olive oil, spices. Okay, let's give this plus up with these with the harissa a go. Mm. Mm -hmm. That harissa, just a little bit of heat, nicely uh, smoky, sweet, has really enlivened this sandwich significantly. Well, I have to say the original it was tasty. It was good. I'm going to go ahead and give that a good seven. Plus up with the Zwitta Harissa. Man, that's like an eight and a half right now. That is so complex and delicious. Still getting all the freshness from the tomato and the lettuce. The mayonnaise bring the richness and the tuna. But now you're getting this warm spice blend, smokiness, and just a little bit of heat. It's so good. Yeah, I'm definitely going to finish that. And I would make the plus up version again any day. All right. See you tomorrow. <laughs>